Today I'm going to highlight this photograph on canvas of the world famous Lake O'Hara. If you're not familiar with where Lake O'Hara is, it is west of Lake Louise a little bit. So if you're familiar with Lake Louise, you have that big glaciated peak in the background, which is Mount Victoria. If you were to jump over to the other side of Mount Victoria, you would end up in Lake O'Hara region. And it's just right inside Yoho National Park, just on the BC side of the BC Alberta border. So this photograph is printed at 40 by 60 inches on canvas. It's a mounted canvas, which means it's on a hard backing. And this one in particular does require framing, but I can also do them as a stretched canvas, which is completely wall ready. This one is all set for framing and it's available in other sizes for like 16 by 24 and up, either on canvas or as a print. So this photograph is taken just on the other side of the cabins. There's a little trail that goes around the lake uh, coming in around it clockwise, you end up at this viewpoint and you could look across the first portion of the lake and you can see the cabins here right along the lake shore. The lake extends around this and there's cabins on the other side there as well. You have these nice wispy clouds and that beautiful, beautiful diffused gorgeous light that adds that nice soft light onto the mountain tops there. It's uh, taken very early in the morning as the sun's coming up which is why you get that nice kind of warm golden hued light and in this case i wanted to get all these kind of rocks uh, that are submerged along the shoreline uh, because the reflection of the peak kind of blends in with the rocks on the shoreline but there's enough separation in there from the light that it kind of complements it and it just looks like a real cool vantage point so that's what caught my eye with this one if you've never been to Lake O'Hara, I highly, highly recommend going in there. The, the lake is gorgeous and there's some really absolutely amazing hikes that leave from the lake. Uh, they do run a school bus up there. It's a 12 kilometer gravel road each, uh, each way, so 12 kilometers one way. You hop on the school bus and it gives you a ride up the road. Uh, otherwise, you could hike it. I don't really recommend it. All the good hiking starts from the lake itself. Uh, the road to get up there is rather boring, but once you're there, man, like, you have these phenomenal views and really, really great hikes to all these different areas that you can explore. If you can get up there and camp for a weekend, I'd recommend that. The cabins, if you can afford to stay at those cabins, go for it. I mean, there's nothing wrong with a bit of luxury uh, while you're out hiking. So yeah, if you're interested in this piece, give me a shout.